Hi guys, I'm Kristen, you're watching Kay's Perfect Fitness TV. So we are in week two of your How to Slim Down Your Waistline series. So if you haven't seen week one, head over and check out uh, week's one workout. It's going to follow the same formula as that one, which starts with your nine minute reverse hit pyramid. So we do the high intensity interval training to help you burn and shed that belly fat so we can see your waistline for one. And then it's going to be followed by a six minute abs routine, which will heavily focus on those obliques to get you a tight and toned waist. So um, make sure you are pairing this, like I said, with your healthy, clean, lean, and green diet and your good quality sleep. We need to make sure we are resting and recovering as well as working out. And make sure you head over to my website to download your free workout calendar. I've made your training so easy for you that all you have to do is click the workout on each day and you will have your workout scheduled for you. So get that free workout calendar. Now on to our workout. Do your warm up really quick. You can pick any warm up. I want you to just do a quick three minute warm up. Pause this video and come back. Okay. You should be warmed up. I'm warmed up. I'm ready to go. And we are going to go into our HIT training, our reverse pyramid. So our first exercise, 55 seconds, and it's a seal jack. So we're going to squat. Down and clap, up and clap. Down and clap, up and clap. Down and up. Down and up. So already you can see this is a lot more movement than we had last week. Woo! We're not wasting any time. We're picking it up here. Just make sure you get those heels down as you squat down. Drop your booty down. Drop your hips back. If you're really struggling to squat and stand, okay? If you're really struggling to get all those seal jacks in, we always have another option if you are more of a non-jumper. All right, guys, rest. Our next move is a walkout up in a burpee. So we're gonna roll down, walk our hands out, walk it back in, and jump. Walk it out, walk it in, and jump. So if you don't wanna jump at the top, just stand up tall. And you can also, Reach your hands up to the ceiling. A few options for you here. I want to make this work for everyone. And jump up, jump to the other side, and jump up. Here we go. Now, if you're a non jumper, you can leap to the side and lift, leap and lift, leap and lift. Bring your weight side to side. 
right there. Good job, guys. Rest and roll up. Now our last move is going to be three jumps forward and one top jump. So a lot of jumps today. You can see my heart rate is already up. I'm already out of breath. I need to catch my breath. Okay, so three jumps. It looks like this. One, two, three, and tuck. One, two, three, and tuck. Now on that tuck jump, get your knees up into your chest. And on these four jumps, get your heels down. Bend your knees. If you don't want to do that tuck jump, take a squat. And if you're really struggling with those jumps, march and squat. All right, so a few options for you guys. Good, rest. You have 25 seconds to catch your breath. Now we are ready to reverse the pyramid. So we're gonna head back down to the floor. You have 40 seconds of walking push-ups. So catch your breath, grab a drink of water if you need it. You're doing so well, guys. Week two is going very strong, I can tell. All right. Lift up, walk to the side, go push up. Remember if you need it, just drop those knees down, that's absolutely fine. your jumps side and up side and up we have 45 seconds 45 seconds on the jump so we have 20 seconds rest here oh, nice one seconds that was it so jump and lift jump and lift keep it light keep it lifted I feel like an energizer bunny huh so these workouts are short and sweet, but they really do a trick. And remember, like I said, when you pair these with good nutrition and a proper amount of sleep, you can get amazing results fast. Everyone's gonna react and change differently at different times, but you just make this work for you. If you like any new moves, Feel free to videotape yourself and tag me on Instagram. I want to see you doing these workouts. Okay, guys? Woo! All right, into our walkout and burpee. So, down, walk it out, into a full plank, walk it back in, and jump, and reach up. You know what to expect. It doesn't seem as hard. So hang in there, guys. Because after this, you only have one more move left. You know what's coming? It's your seal jack. You know, 55 seconds.
you guys. Enjoy your five seconds to rest. And that's it. I'm now quickly going to set this back up. Ready for our ab sequence. Six minutes. 50 seconds on. 10 seconds rest. Six rounds, I promise. That is it. You can do this hanging with me. Finish these six minutes. You've done your 15 minute waistline workout. So we burn the fat. We've raised our metabolic rate to help you burn fat throughout the rest of the day. And then we're gonna really tighten and tone up those abs. Work your whole core, especially those obliques. So lie down on your mat. Okay. Take your hands outside your ears. Feet down, knees bent. We're twisting and lifting and lower. Twist and lift and lower. So we're reaching your opposite rib to hip today. Opposite rib to hip. Make sure you exhale on the way up. Inhale on the way down. We're twisting the shoulder across the body. Keeping the hips and pelvis very still. And make sure that your hands are just there to support your head, not pulling on the head good. You have 10 seconds. We're gonna pick our feet up and take our hands out to the sides. So one leg up the tabletop and then the other. Brace those abs. Make sure you kind of contract your glutes a bit, finding a nice imprint where you can hold and stabilize this position. We're gonna slowly drop knees over to one side. Inhale here. And exhale, bring them back up to the ceiling. And then take them over to the other side. Hold them for that split second. Inhale. Exhale. Use your abs to bring them back up the center. Position. One hand on the floor. So now it's my left hand and right foot lifting up and down. Twist and lift and then lower. Lift and twist. Reach. Reach your hand, touch your toe. You 
doing really, really well, guys. We have one more exercise to complete after this one. training calendar so that way you know when to do this workout again this week followed by all the other workouts you need to get in this week as well I promise you they will fit into your schedule it's so easy to follow and it's free how amazing is that so no excuses not to keep yourself healthy and fit this year so thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you next week for week three prepare yourself it's gonna go up another level so uh, something to look forward to and I'll see you then until then Thanks for watching Kate's Perfect Fitness TV.